Well, during these difficult economic times, Cumberland County officials are helping some unemployed and others turn to an alternative as would-be entrepreneurs. South Jersey Bureau Chief Kent St. John has the story. Cumberland County is New Jersey's poorest with double-digit unemployment. The state-run one-stop career center here offers employment training, veteran services, vocational rehabilitation, and more. Recently, the New Jersey Small Business Development Center, a Newark-based nonprofit, opened an office here. The mission to help entrepreneurs. Where we have a small business development center, where we're going to assist businesses in developing um, business plans, either new businesses or existing businesses that are finding themselves under great economic ch uh, challenge right now. The center is a satellite office run in conjunction with Richard Stockton College in Atlantic County. It almost didn't open because of budget cuts. But the Cumberland County Empowerment Zone, Community Development Corporation, and Urban Enterprise Zone from Vineland, Millville, and Bridgeton pooled their money to come up with the $100,000 to fund the office. We also have learned a long time ago that we can collaborate and work well together. Uh, and it, we have done shared services before people started talking about it, and this is another example. This Vineland Bakery is having sweet success thanks to the program. Owners say the help was invaluable. So they really helped us solidify our plans and put us on the right path towards building a business plan, getting the funding, and everything else that went along with opening the business. The co-owner of the bakery says the decision to open a business during these tough economic times was not an easy one. Certainly was not the greatest time, but we really can't complain. We've been doing well, um, but it's a matter of just keeping up our quality, keeping up the customer service, so that when people do have some money to spend, they're more likely to spend it here. The director of the center says now is the time to help those willing to help themselves. And I think in these unprecedented mm -hmm. financial times and this economic climate we're in, people need to be proactive. The timing and the conditions were perfect for this, uh, this collaboration. Jarnette Mercado wants to open a daycare center for children with special needs. She is relying on help from the SBDC to get started. You know, and if we can get more into the special needs area, there are a lot of children that have therapeutic needs that a lot of agencies are turning away, and we want to be their safe haven. We want to provide an area for them to be able to come in and have resources and be able to function in everyday community. Molino says Mercado is just the type of client they are looking for. They have not only just resources, but there's more one-on-one -on -one, so that there's somebody there walking you through it and helping you to establish to the day that you open the doors and even after that it's kind of like a partnership. Ken St. John, NJN News, Vineland, Cumberland County.